are the teams that make their home in Lodge Grass, Montana, and they are the best. And the champion rider by the name of Dustin Kruger, he's coming back to the Red Line Green, an outstanding team that's won the big ones all over the country from Seattle, Washington to Minneapolis, St. Paul area. This is SNM Express. Give them a round of applause. They represent all of the nation. And ladies and gentlemen, here is another team in the beautiful Lime Green. And they come from a place called Insulin. Washington on the Colville Indian Reservation. An outstanding rider by the name of Terrence Hofer will be doing the right, and they call themselves Arrow Lake. And in yellow, right in the middle of the traffic, from out of the Showman Nation, out of Fort Hall, Idaho, welcome Putnam Reilly. They are in blue, and ridden this afternoon by a pro Indian jockey by the name of Randy Moxon. A young man who is now making his name in the sport of Indian relay. In green, from out of Busby, Montana, anybody from Busby, Montana, here is Groundstone, and a young fellow by the name of Chance Alden, who is going to be doing the writing, and Dave Groundstone is the team captain. And ladies and gentlemen, here is the team that won the big Muckle Shoot Gold Cup in Washington just about a month ago. One of all, one of the best in the business. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome world champion rider Scotty Abrahamson and the Abrahamson Relay. This is the best. Sharon, what you've got here in front of you are the best in the world in the sport of all in the world. is in second, putting them really, Arrow Lakes, and Roundstone. Around the turn they go, Abrahamson, and s and is battling it out as they go around the turn, and down the back stretch they go. In post position number one, it's going to be Abrahamson. s and Express is right there. As they make their way towards the top of the turn, s and is pulling up first, and Abrahamson drives right by him along the rail, in third, it's going to be the team of Putnam Relay. Putnam Relay. and s and Express. They are the top teams in the world going right now. And it is going to be down the back stretch. And it is going to be s and is in second in following Abrahamson by about six and a half lengths. In third is Errol Lakes with Terrence Holford. In third, in fourth, it's going to be Rounds Putnam Relay. It is going to be close as they come down the backside. Abrahamson has about ten and a half lengths over the team of Arrow Lakes. Arrow Lakes and another gap of about five and a half lengths is S and M. Now coming home in front of the first.
giving it all he's got as he goes down the far first turn, the clubhouse turn, and down around towards the back stretch. It is going to be rounds, though. They want a time in this event. They want to move up into the next possible constellation because their time, the way it sits right now, is not going to be good enough to come into the championship round unless catastrophic events happen. But here he comes. Ladies and gentlemen, help out the Roundstones. David Roundstones, Gene Cazold, and other ladies. In order to have a good run, you have to have all the possible elements that could go.